not P square. The, mo the money I had with me is P square's money. Hey guys, welcome back again to my channel. So guys, Jude Okoye, the brother of the twins, Peter and Paul, actually came out to talk about the issue that's going around the internet today concerning Peter and Paul. He came out to talk his own part because a lot of people have been blaming him. A lot of people have been saying a lot of things about him, that he is the main cause of what is happening between the twins, Peter and Paul today. This whole thing started when Peter actually came out in his social media handle to write an open letter to his twin brother, Paul Okoye. And he made a lot of comments, a lot of talks, and he reviewed a lot and a lot of things that has been going on in this open letter. A lot and a lot of comments were made after this post was made. Many people also accused Jude Okoye for being the one responsible for the whole issue. This issue has really, really caused a lot of reactions online. A lot of people has been talking about it, including Peter Obi was seen visiting the twins separately. He visited Peter, Peter separately, and he also visited Paul and Jude separately. The rumors has been online that it was for them to make peace, but the real conversation has not really been told why he actually visited the twins. So guys, Jude Okoye have actually come out to talk about this issue. So guys, let's listen to what he has to say about this whole issue, guys. Um, like I said, uh, I might be like kind of repeating myself again. My wife has nothing to do with this. It's just royalties that Peter was receiving and not sharing anymore. Paul was receiving, not sharing anymore, that I was receiving and was sharing with them, as we speak, that I got four years ago. That is what they are taking me to UFCC for. Because according to Peter, I am not P square. That's just the basis of the truth, the basic of the whole matter. I am not P square. The, mo the money I had with me is P square's money. Because I am not P square, I'm just the manager that they put on salary. In this question you see going on, whatever the outcome comes, I've given them the evidence to prove that I'm not just P square, I am equal as P square as they are. But in the eyes of the public, to two of them are P square. I don't have any problem with that. But on documentation, I am equal as them as P square. Even more, but I am not charging that. I'm just being equal with them as P square. So that is about the EFCC case and about my wife's own case. Like I said, please. Uh, easy with the comment section leave her out of it i understand what you guys are, are feeling about peter's story no worries i if if i if, i don't want to cross that line with him peter has crossed a very serious line taking this matter to efcc but i'm telling you honestly if i cross that line with him it's going to be uh, two people uh, uh, it's like a pig that's playing in the mud and you're putting on white and you decide to go and join the pig in the mud it's not going to look good on me to cross that line like i'm going to sit with that bigger person that bigger brother to look at it with a different perspective but first of all i need to go and defend myself so my defending myself now means that i have to go and put in a petition so that they can also be investigated and that money that i am also receiving that is in my account that he was petitioning about, they also see the same money in their own account. That's why I put in the petition too. Aside that, I don't have any qualms with Peter, I don't have any qualms with Paul, I don't have any qualms with anybody. It's been eight years, why can't they just let me be? Why can't they just let me be? Every time Jude deciding with Paul, Paul deciding with Jude, Paul, like I repeat, Paul, sued with Peter to get me removed from P Square. Is that on siding? Paul signed, which I told they are going to release very soon on Monday. Paul signed to whom he may consign. Everybody that is holding P Square catalog, if it's Peter and Paul's catalog, nobody else is in charge of the catalog. Nobody else has a right, right to be in the catalog. Peter signed it, Paul signed it, and they sent it out to the people. The people sent it to me. I have it with me. Is that one siding with me? That's I'm not siding with anybody. Nobody's siding with me. I'm just siding with the truth. 
and that has always been the fact. So, if I'm not, if I've not been with you for eight years, don't have any transaction with you for eight years, what am I still doing in your problems? If I've not done anything with you for eight years, please, what am I still doing with your problems? Not P square. The, mo the money I had with me is P square's money, because I am not P square. I'm just the manager that they put on salary. In this situation you see going on, whatever the outcome comes, I've given them the evidence to prove that I'm not just P square, I am equal as P square as they are. But in the eyes of the public, to two of them are P square. I don't have any problem with that. But on documentation, I am equal as them as P square. Even more, but I am not charging that. I'm just being equal with them as P square. So that is about the EFCC case and about my wife's own case. Like I said, please. Uh, easy with the comment section leave her out of it i understand what you guys are, are feeling about peter's story no worries i if if i if, i don't want to cross that line with him peter has crossed a very serious line taking this matter to efcc but i'm telling you honestly if i cross that line with him it's going to be uh, two people uh, uh, it's like a pig that's playing in the mud and you're putting on white and you decide to go and join the pig in the mud it's not going to look good on me to cross that line like i'm going to see with that bigger person that bigger brother to look at it with a different perspective so guys after jude actually made this post a lot of people still came on his comment section and they dropped a lot of comments in his comment section some of the few of this comment section which i'll be reading here so this person said how are you equal to peace Corps? it's the entitlement for me know your position a manager is a manager know your place so guys another person also made a comment another person said you don't sound convincing at all and why did you and why did paul lie that peter called efcc for him you have always cited paul making peter feel left out do the right thing Oga, and stop beating around the bush trying to vindicate yourself whereas you are the architect of this whole problem so guys a lot and a lot of people made a lot of comments about this post. A lot of people were saying a lot of things and they dropped a lot of comments in this comment section. So guys, let me know what you think about this issue in the comment section. Is Jude actually right? Is Paul and Peter actually the cause of their own problem or is Jude actually the architect of this problem? Let me know what you think in the comment section guys and please guys don't forget to hit the subscribe button because we'll be giving you more trending gist on this channel see you in my next video bye